What you doing on the AC? And this is Otaku News Reviews. I am talking about Fabricant 100 by Daisuke Nishima, Chapter 31, Self-Sacrifice for Whom? This chapter came out on July 23rd, 2023, and it's the typical 19 pages. Ugh, okay, so I'm not crazy about this chapter, and I think it's just because I'm so tired of this, like, rehash of self-sacrificing blah 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 I almost didn't even want to do this because like there's nothing new to really say about this I can't at least go over what happens I guess anyway so the first page just more of Yako go on about self-sacrifice stuff whatever and then it cuts to Kagui after he slash 86 and then the only good part of the chapter is it looks like 86 is going to heal back right away but no 100 comes in smashes the core good not no chance of letting 86 come back just get it done and over with i like that normally the stuff like this is drawn out unfortunately the self-sacrifice stuff keeps getting drawn out because there's more self-sacrifice talk ayoko's dying and yeah there's a little bit of humor in this now because she's like all sacrifice does is lead to pain like literally she's in pain she says that it's like oh, okay well at least it's gonna be humorous right now oh i'm so tired of it i'm glad it's finally going to be over after this i'm sure there'll be more like references or flashbacks to this moment because it's an important moment ayoko does die uh we and so it is kind of like her last dying word so i should be i don't know more empathetic towards it but i'm tired of it and then not only that even kagui it's like you could have you should have been able to avoid that and he's like the invitation got to you just, just like, mm -hmm. but yeah at least yako was helpful again because she, apparently she caught a glimpse of a map that leads to number one's base and then another kind of interesting point is 100 compares herself to Ayako. They're saying they're like two peas in a pod. And because three points uh, only values yourself, uh, fought for your own benefit, and wouldn't hurt yourself for others. Which, that's really making Ayako sound worse. But it's also 100 has done this. Yeah, the whole reason 100 is doing this is to get Ashibi's blood but like wouldn't hurt herself for others she has she literally catches herself on fire now so maybe it kind of shows like yeah yako's maybe like fabricants or maybe 100's kind of like humans because they're both kind of like this and kind of not i don't know then it cuts to a flashback of stuff they've already talked about yako and kagui as kids not knowing they were doing something wrong and no one getting onto them about it because they were afraid of them not even the parents they already said all that stuff before and that their master was the only one that really disciplined them and because of that he actually respected them or they respected him and they won't be like him and take over dojo of course we saw earlier how that worked out for him and of course that's not happening especially because the yaku's dead now too okay and now we get to actual development because the rest of that like i said most of it was just yeah we already know this stuff blah blah, blah self-sacrifice we get it okay let's go on cut to number one bringing back 99 and then 99 uses giant ass moves Woo! yeah number one even says like okay at the cost of his base being revealed they got they killed a four star severely injured uh five star and whatever it'd be easier if they come to him anyways especially if 99 can do this they must have beat 99 before though so either he got even more upgrades which he probably did he's probably even stronger now or i don't know i guess other uh, there's just less people now since they fought 99 originally i'm assuming we're gonna get some flashbacks of the original fights and that's gonna be pretty cool but yeah it's starting to finally feel like in game kind of stuff it's getting towards the end and as much as like oh this could keep going on i was expecting 100 at most i at this point it might actually be in. I'm so disappointed they didn't do the more of the amusement part. They literally walked in, went to one attraction, and was like, here it is. And there was so much other cool stuff that could have happened. There was only two fabricants at that whole place. <sighs> it's disappointing. But, yeah, that's it for this chapter. Uh, interesting thing, 100 says. A little kind of cool action with Kagui 100. Very brief. And then, number one, bringing 99 back. That's the big moment. And it looks pretty cool. It's going to be a cool fight. See where that goes. And since 99 uses ice and 100 uses fire. Ooh, but the ice is a lot bigger than 100's fire so far. So, 
we'll just have to see where that goes is it going it'll probably be a while until they actually fight fight but they, they could run into each other at any moment i'm sure there would be some in-between chapters just preparing for it but I don't know, I, I just, this whole chapter just, like, disappointing me, so it's hard to get hype for what's coming next, even though these last few pages were cool, I don't know, but just the title, more Cypher Sacrifice stuff, that's it, it's finally gonna be done, ooh, okay, but yeah, let's talk about it. what did you think of this chapter, uh, what do you think of number one, number nine, where do you think it's gonna go, let's talk about all that stuff, you can leave a comment, you can find me on social media, the AC Stories, you can email me at theacstories at gmail.com, or join my discord little group there and hey no other thing i have a kofi or coffee however people want to pronounce it. i have that it's mainly for writing but i include my notes for the videos in my two dollar tier so if you want to join that and help support me so i can keep doing this stuff go ahead and do that links to everything i just mentioned will be in the description like usual but that's all I have to say about this chapter of Everyone 100. If you like what I had to say, go ahead and give it a like. You will easily keep up with me. Go ahead and subscribe. But until next time, I'm the AC. Thank you so much. Bye.